welcome back to our channel. We are looking at bucket posing today. So that's something that I struggled with for a really long time. Um, but I finally feel like I've got it down. But it's the deeper buckets and this is where you position the baby. You literally set the baby in straight up and they're kind of sitting there holding their little hands up. So I'm going to show you how we stage that bucket. Again, this is just a little fleece in our basket tutorial um, video and how to set up your baskets, we use this, and this is really something I use in almost every single shoot. So I'm just gonna place this in, but what I do with the bucket posing, because you do need the depth in the center, I'm going to actually roll this up and around and then place it in the bucket. So that way my center still has that little gap in it. And then I'm gonna start just taking Random. I'm not. I'm not really focusing on any type of color here because we're just. Um, we just need the height, so that's all going to be covered. So then I take another piece and I just kind of roll. Just this is a piece of little felt rug. We don't really use it for seeing or no. We don't want people looking at it in the videos. Oh, and I need. I am missing. Um, one of the. Uh, blanket posers because I need that. All right, so you take this and yes, and put it around the rim of the basket. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is take this is a bean bag poser. It's just one of those big blankets that you get. You can use anything though. Um, you could use another fleece. So I'm going to take this though, and I'm going to keep it folded into the little squares. And then I'm going to start rolling, and I do roll this one a little bit tighter than I would say if I was doing a basket pose, because you want um, cushioning, I guess I should say, for the baby, because if the baby's in the bucket, you want something protecting the baby from hitting the rim of the bucket, um, or basket, or whatever you're using for this. So we're going to roll, 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 and then again, we're going to place it around the rim. So that gives me the depth right there in the center, and I can pretty much stick my whole arm in. So when the baby's wrapped, I do all my bucket posing with the babies in a wrap. That way you don't have loose limbs hanging everywhere and you're, you know, stuffing them in. I just take them in their little, in their little cocoon and I place them right in the middle. And this has actually turned out to be a really easy shot. Um, and then, of course, once you've got the baby in there, well, and then you want to throw something in to cover all of your stuff. So we'll throw that in, and then there's our little hole for our baby. And then we've got some pretty little fringe going there. And you can throw another layer in if you want another layer. Just make sure when you're doing your layers and you're tossing those in, you're not blocking your hole or your gap for your newborn. And then once you put the baby in, just start kind of positioning with the bean bags and just prop them up where you need. You don't want their heads leaned back. You want their heads to stay up. So one thing with the bucket posing is I will use a lot of bean bags behind the head just to give them that boost to keep them positioned correctly in the picture. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe to our channel. Like us on Facebook. Facebook is in the link below. Y'all have a great day. Thanks so much. Bye.